A once close companion of Prophet Muhammad became gravely ill, leading to significant weight loss and incapacitation. Hearing of his friend's dire condition, the Prophet made a visit, realizing the man's life was nearing its end. He devoted his time to comforting the ailing man, whose spirits lifted remarkably at the sight of the Prophet, considering his visit a miraculous gift amidst his suffering. The sick man expressed gratitude for his ailments, believing they had brought him the fortune of the Prophet's presence, viewing his pain as a blessing rather than a curse. However, when the Prophet learned that the man had been praying for pain, he was taken aback, advising him he had been praying mistakenly, equating his pleas to requesting harm rather than blessings. The ill man explained his mindset, feeling overwhelmed by guilt for past sins and fearing divine punishment. In desperation, he prayed to endure earthly suffering to avoid damnation in the afterlife, leading to his current state of immense suffering, which made him forget his sins and prayers. Moved by the man's condition and repentance, the Prophet counseled him to seek ease and goodness in life, encouraging prayers for a benevolent path through life leading to God. The Prophet's visit and wisdom offered the man comfort and a new perspective on prayer and suffering, leaving him with a message of hope and guidance for a better approach to faith and repentance. The story concludes with the Prophet's departure, leaving the man to reflect on the lessons learned, hopeful for a more merciful transition from this world to the next.